This is the billboard that just went up. It's located around the corner from the Vallejo Police Department. Sean Monarosa's family want officers to see the young man's face every day. It holds a special place in our hearts because we'd always come here with our brother. Michelle and Ashley Monarosa think about their brother all the time. This spot on Billy Goat Hill is where the three would hang out since they were children. He's always with us. The light's shining on my face and I feel like it's with him. He's with us. The sisters want Vallejo police to think of him daily too. 22-year-old Sean Monarosa was shot and killed by a Vallejo police officer in June. The officer fired his assault rifle from the back seat through the windshield of an unmarked police truck. After police say the officer mistook the hammer found in Monarosa's sweatshirt for a gun. Officer Jarrett Tan, the officer that murdered my brother, is off paid leave and back in Vallejo working. With financial help from the community, the sisters have put up a billboard near the Vallejo Police Department. When they're driving in and out, you're going to see it, whether you're going home or you're going to work. You know, so it's going to be in your face every day. The Monterosas plan to switch the billboard out over the next six months with the faces of other men killed at the hands of Vallejo police. Officers here have shot more than 30 people since 2010. And I will do everything in my power to make sure we bring change. We reached out to the Vallejo Police Department for comment, but they did not reply. The billboard will be officially unveiled on Sunday. In Vallejo, I'm Jody Hernandez, NBC Bay Area News.